Nearly 400 people from across the country showed up at Coleman University in Kearney Mesa today to audition for ABC's hit show Shark Tank. 10 News was there live this morning as people were lining up. Reporter Marie Cornell shows us what hopefuls did to stand out. I go crazy with it. Attracts a lot of attention. Can you see me now? Can you see me now? They did just about anything to keep the attention on them. A chocolate foot. After all, they only had one minute to convince these producers they should make it to the next round. 3,500 stores in the U.S. One step closer to getting here, pitching their product to the sharks on ABC's Shark Tank. They could get some serious cash. So how would you use that 400000 specifically? Among the crowd of hundreds, 10 News found body wipes to tablet holders and even decorative high-heeled shoes. Just the lights flash too. See the lights right there. Bruce Lamb promoted his protective cases for instruments, focusing on performance. <laughs> well, I'm kind of a show off when it comes to this thing. You know, it's just people got to know about it. Others like Lowell Cohen used a calmer approach. He used models to present his custom made t shirts for kids. Make a child become anything they'd ever want to be. So once they put our t shirt on, they become the character of their choice. Before making it into the holding area where hopefuls anxiously waited for their audition, people waited outside, some even sleeping here overnight. The first person in line got there 1 a.m. Friday. And from there, the line just kept growing. Now, all the hopefuls have to do is wait to find out if they get a call back in the coming weeks. What are you going to use it for? I use it for the. I'm Courtney Mesa, Marie Cornell, 10 News.